to get married. As he said, he sort of like have eyes that went looking. As he said, we met at the Islamic Center uh, doing activities and so on. And at a given point, we had to do some counseling for some sisters. And we end up doing the counseling together. So that's how we get to interact with one another. And then uh, he decided, uh, I believe I'm um, the wife he shows, so his life partner. And Alhamdulillah, here we are sitting. Alhamdulillah, shukur. It's a little bit different from, uh, let's say, the, your Christian or secular perspective because the, the criteria that Muslims use is, uh, uh, is, is extremely important. In Islam, we don't say that we love somebody. Uh, we look for the person that completes us. In, uh, it, we are taught within Islam that our, uh, our deen, our religion, is ha within our deen, marriage is half of it. Meaning that the idea of being married or the whole principle of being married is fundamental to your success as a human being. Not only in the sense of procreation, but also in the sense of your interaction with the rest of the world. I seriously doubt that you can be a good citizen, a good boss, a good worker if you're not a good husband. Uh, it is the completion that it provides for you. You seek somebody that fills in uh, the holes that you have in your own personality, in your own soul. And it is the person that can provide you with the support that you need in the times that you are under more stress or duress or uh, where you have, a, let's say, a lack of faith in yourself or in life. The principle of uh, love in Islam is different from, uh, let me say, the Western world or so on where you have to fall in love and it turn into lust and then it end up in fornication and stuff like that.